Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Back to the Future, the game. Today we're doing episode 3, Citizen Brown, and as usual, this is being live streamed on Twitch, twitch.tv slash trunks if you want me to play these live. JP Penny! JP Penny! New game. I love how they're all considered separate games. I don't know, not that it really matters. Hey. Uh... Before we begin, would you like to know if you can show goals? Yes, considering how bad I am with this game, yes. I would like this game to kind of handhold me a bit. I'm playing this for the story. Because the hell with the gameplay of this game. That's very lacking. <clears throat> so, yeah. You know. Alright. Half hour into the stream, we're finally starting the game. Thursday, May 15th, 1986. Hill Valley, Southgate. Why is there a wall around Hill Valley? I know, holy crap, what the hell happened to Jennifer? Uh, whoops! Uh, that's a thing. Hmm. Episode 3, Citizen Brown. Written and designed by J.D. Star. Relax, we have everything under control. First, Citizen Brown. Oh, no. Oh, I don't like where this is gonna go. Really don't like where this is gonna go. It's gonna be interesting though. <clears throat> Directed. I mean, it's a game. I mean, how do you really direct? Okay, whatever. Story against something. Bob Gale, one of the original writers of Back to the Future. Which is cool. He probably gave some ideas of where to go. Something that wasn't 1885, 1955. We've got everything under control. Yeah, not to travel 1985 or 2015. Um. You. Citizen Brown. That's Doc, all right, but what the heck's going on here? Where's his hair? It kind of creeps me out. Jennifer! This is the dumbest design ever. Yeah, really? Uh, hello? I mean, it's a DeLorean. You can't hear me. Um, do I have something I can throw? <laughs> she can't hear me. Throw it! She can't hear me. Damn you. You're going to need help. Try to get somebody's... Oh, no shit on that. There's a girl down the street. You're in a car. What in a car is good for getting... Oh, yeah. There's not much left. So what's the point? Don't worry, everybody. I'm okay. The billboard broke my the fall. The billboard broke your fall, uh-huh. There it is. That's what I'm like. Alright, how do I honk the horn? First I thought to throw something at her. What the hell? Hey, did you give me a... Jennifer? See, I knew that was Jennifer. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, that's a thing. Hi. Jennifer, I need some help. Martin? It is you. Is that a DeLorean? Maybe. Uh, well, yeah, it's a DeLorean. What else would it be? How the hell did it get into the billboard like that? Uh, Never mind that. Just give me a hand, okay? Yeah, really. Yep, yep. Really? That's a hand. So who are you supposed to be? Luke or Bo? This isn't funny, Jennifer. Luke or Bo? Bo? We have a Bo in chat right now? What? What? What's the oh, date? Man. What's the date? What? That's something I should be asking you. You've probably wrecked your head. Just, what's the date, Jennifer? Yeah, really. It's the 15th. The year. 1986. Duh. Ah, shit. Oh, man. Oh, man. This can't be happening. This can't be happening. Jennifer, you look so different. That's the general idea of being a nonconformist. Yeah. That's not what I meant. What are you getting As at? If, uh, yeah. What are you wearing, Jen? You look so... Fed up. Keen eye you got there. I was mm -hmm. going to say punk. 
A whole world alien to the likes of you, dork. Whoa! Never mind. I gotta get out of this car. Yeah, really. Just get me out of this car, please. Can you help me down? Yeah, really. Can you Why help you me down? Jump! I'll break my neck. And. The door's jammed. Can you get it open? Yeah, can you get I can't it open? Reach it. Besides, I'm not climbing under the car. It could come down on my head. She's got a point. You got any rope you can toss me? Uh-uh. All I have is this rusty wrench thing I found in the dirt. A tire iron. I think that'll do. Toss it here. Oh, back off, Martin. This is my witch it. What do you give me for it? Uh... Uh, what are you, what are you doing? doing down there? Yeah, what are you doing down I there? You'd ever understand it, but I'm doing my part to support the arts in Hill Valley. Anyway, what's the technical term for attempting to jump your DeLorean through a billboard? Yeah, really. Where did you even get a DeLorean? Is it stolen? Don't worry about it, it's docs. A little complicated. A little complicated. All right, let me think this through. Don't strain your brain, Geekzilla. Nice. There. Jennifer. This is all I got. Is there anything in it? Give it here. Aha. Ah, she caught it. Ugh. It smells like armpits and booze. Irving Kid Tannen, the gangster? Where the hell did you get this? Oh, it's a uh, long story. Can I just have the tire iron? By the way, this is a time machine. Help! Heads up! Thanks! Oh, great. Now what? I don't know. Oops. Oh. I can get out now, at least. Might want to grab that. Might be useful. <clears throat> Aha! Well, your dorkness, my debt to society is paid. As for you, Good luck with your car. Way to stick it to Big Brother. Just don't expect your sudden cry for attention to change anything between us, dig? It doesn't change what? Look, Jennifer, I think there are some things we need to talk about. Hey, maybe you can uh -huh. give me a lift into town. Oh, sure, Martin. Climb on in. And she's gonna drive right off. Jennifer, I knew it! I told you, we're through, McFly. I'll never date such a square again. Square? My own girlfriend thinks I'm a square? That's embarrassing. Jesus, could this get any worse? Wait for it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, rip the DeLorean. That's bad. That's really bad. How are we gonna? Uh, he kicks the tire. Ah, it didn't work very well, huh? I, think I could really use your help right about now. M. I don't think she's a girlfriend, but no shit. We've got everything under control. Huh. <laughs> Not anymore, suspect. <laughs> it's a whoa. Wheel. Well, at least one of the hover wheels work. Yeah, totally. Can I look at it? Like. Dead. Well. 15th, 1986. Yeah, the, the date's right, but. Shit's been changed. Oh, oh. That's not good. Car's dead. This is gonna be interesting. And if you guys remember, possibly go around the entire things city. changed back in 1930 something or other. I forget the exact date. Or was it the 20s? Squawk box. Hi. Uh, check, check. Sibilance, sibilance. Who is this? Stop messing with the intercom. Oh, ha, ha, hi. Can you buzz me in? Visitors must check in at the North Gate. Oh, North Gate? I'm not walking clear around Hill Valley. There's got to be another way. Um. Climb the gate? How the hell do you get through these? Climb it? There's a security camera. Hi! Hi. Hi. No! 
Let's see. What am I missing? What am I missing? I look good. Nothing over here. Oh, wait a second before you uh, use the hover wheel and fly over. Oh, God. That's a terrible idea. Let's do it. It's barely hanging on to the axle. All of this because Doc got some action. Exactly. This all happened because Doc okay, good. got laid. This could be useful. Now, See? Funny. That's a bad Thanks. thing. I guess you don't want him to get laid, I guess. I don't know. Dangers of women. Yeah, really. Women are so now dangerous. That's off the car, it looks like but the you can't help but love them. The hover system have disconnected. And by dangerous, I mean it's a good thing. What? What? What, what did he now say? Now that it's off the car, it looks like the power cables for the hover system have disconnected. Uh-huh. Is there something I can grab out of it? Yeah. This is the second time I've completely destroyed Doc's really? time machine. I just shouldn't be allowed to drive it anymore. Wait, how do you completely destroy it? To oh, never mind. So we need... Oh, battery! That's it. I'm like, there's gotta be something. 12 volts. Wait, this is the car battery? <clears throat> it must have been installed in 2015 with the Mr. Fusion. Still has plenty of juice. Mm-hmm. Go. Cool. Probably take out the battery and then click on it. Let's see here. Red to positive, black, black to, to negative. negative. Get on it. Whoa. There. Oof. That works. My tire. It's Why? a UFO. It's a UFO. Okay, oh, Doc. No. Let's see what kind of nightmare alternate timeline I've landed in this time. Probably the scariest you've ever been in. I think. Maybe not as bad as the 1985 one from Back to the Future 2? Where Hill Valley has a gigantic... Oh, achievement! 20 points! Hope you're insured! Use the DeLorean parts to enter Hill Valley. Okay, Marty. Nothing to be afraid of. It's just an alternate Hill Valley that's turned my girlfriend into a punk rock vandal. Mm -hmm. That doesn't mean it's full of post-apocalyptic biker gangs run by armies of Biff clones. Just... Take a deep breath and remember, we gotta find Doc. Are you sure that's what you want to do? Hi. Hi. Um. You could be a citizen plus! Oh, God. That's something familiar, like, we want you to join the military. No Valley Unity. Me backwards. Hey, look, it's the heart of town. Oh. You just wait. Also, why the hell are they all wearing the same clothes, right? Right, because they're supposed to. Soup mode. Bureau of Discipline. Oh, shit. Are we getting arrested because we're not wearing the same clothes as everybody? Because this is weird. Never mind. It's so, so clean. Clean. Right? Am I Good orange? Morning, I don't know. Good morning to you, too, citizen. I think the issue is not so much that Doc got laid, but it was the fact that it was Edna. What's going on here, Doc? Edna? Is that her name? Wait, was her name Edna? Now I'm forgetting. Help! My brain! Okay, look at the clock tower. Fancy. Jeez, my Hill Valley never looked this good. Are you sure? Watch where you're going, citizen. Sorry. Right. My, uh, Mr. Parker. That's Officer Parker to you, Martin. Now Parker? what's with the outfit? I, uh... It's Thursday. Yeah? Polo shirt Thursday. Polo you're shirt Thursday. Uniform. That's a violation really? of Civic Ordinance 9 triple -E. 9 triple -E. oh, You're God. not wearing an ID. In direct violation of Ordinance WB714. What are you up to, citizen? I don't know. Polo shirt. Are you on the pot, citizen? Put your arms up. Spread your legs. Hey, wh what are you doing? Quiet. Hold still. This isn't weird at all. Hmm. Nothing. What's your deal today, McFly? Uh. Uh, can you tell me where I could find Doc, uh, Citizen Brown? 
Are you sure you're an honor student? Where do you think he is at this time of day? At work? That's right. Working at the courthouse. Uh-huh. I love the dogs on the side of the... Heavy. Heavy. Yeah, exactly. Hey, what's with the pat down? What do you think, I'm packing heat? Heat? Contraband? Mm. Contraband? You know. Booze, smokes, bubblegum, dogs, circus bubble peanuts? Bubblegum is illegal? Bubblegum? Peanut? You're smart enough to know uh, that ignorance what? of the Civic Ordinance 2XM isn't an excuse. What? Have you seen Jennifer? What's it to you? I thought she broke up with you. <clears throat> yeah, well, I need to talk to her about that. Good luck finding her. I usually don't see her unless she's racking up demerits for her art. Her art. Since when are you a cop? I thought you were a shoe salesman. Are you on something? I've always been a cop. Just like my pa. Great. I've ah. turned my girlfriend's dad into a cop. I've got to finish my beat. Hmm. Are you going to make trouble for me today? No. no. No what? No, sir. That's right, citizen. Okay. No, uh, what am I supposed to say? Sir, apparently. Oh, wait, citizen. Are you about to throw something away? Make sure you use the correct receptacle. That's Hill good. Valley takes pride That's good. Recycling is good. Waste management system. I'll Why give him that. Give him a plus recycling. That can. Make sure it goes into the correct blue receptacle. Is that green, clear, or amber glass? It makes a difference. It does? Remember that all consumable huh. wrapping is tagged with a microchip to help us automatically police litter. That's exciting. I'm all for recycling, but this is out of control. No, it's not. It's fine. I'm okay with that. For everything else, I'm not okay with. Oh, Ben. Step away from the decycling bin, citizen. Decycling? Final resting place for all contraband within Hill Valley. Oh. The decycling bin ensures that socially toxic items will never find their way back into mm. the hands of the general public in any way, shape, or form. So it's where all the cool stuff goes to die. All the cool stuff. If by cool, you mean dangerous. Then yes. Yes, I do mean dangerous. Self tour. What is this? I have to you say. You are standing in front of the Hill Valley Courthouse. Oh. The original courthouse was mm. built in 1885, just 20 years after Hill Valley's incorporation into the state of California. Though the courthouse holds the seat of the local government, it also has been used as a shelter during the recovery period following the 1906 San Francisco earthquake. Pretty sure it's not the same building. Valley's Looks very different. The oh, there's the old... Uh, okay, I can see. No, planting old. roots after that hmm. dreadful disaster. Mm -hmm. In 1976, the downtown renovation project saw the first major additions made to the courthouse since its original construction. Oh, so there are guns the in there. Time to loot! With an additional 128 Man. offices in the new flanking wings and a new mayoral office added to the original clock tower space. Look closely and you can still see some of the original <clears throat> courthouse's wow. details preserved in the new international inspired facade. Sure, I'll hit the buzzer. Hi. Hill Valley Courthouse, how may I help you, citizen? I need to see Doc, or uh, Citizen Brown. Do you have an appointment? Yes. No, but... Then I'm afraid you'll have to wait your turn. Right. When someone asks if you're a guy, do you say yes? That voice sounds familiar. Familiar, you say. Brown. Oh, no. Oh, no. I knew it! Biff? Oh, there he Doc? is. Of course. Doc, wait! I need to talk to you. Hmm. Ministry of Tourism. Wow. I can't see why people would want a vacation here. Yeah, really. Is 
So, uh, where the hell am I supposed to go? What am I supposed to do? I'm slightly confused! Can I go down this way? That's a dead end. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Squawk box! What's the problem, citizen? Oops. Wrong number. Wrong number. Plaque. Commemorating on the 25th day of August this year of our Lord, 1931, the capture and incarceration of Irving Kidd Tannen and the disbanding of his criminal syndicate by the heroic efforts and ingenious mind of our beloved first citizen, Emmett Lathrop Brown, by virtue uh, of his experimental rocket car. Uh, Edna must uh. have written that. Really? First citizen Brown, the mind head of Hill Valley. A man of infinite wisdom and awe-inspiring imagination. Emmett Lathrop Brown had been raised... So that's his middle name. I know it was always Emmett L. Brown, but... Law, but Lathrop? What a name. Until what a middle of names. A the middle gangster Irving Kid Tannen and his bootlegging syndicate. Mm. After this heroic event immortalized by the grand statue on the courthouse lawn, First Citizen Brown devoted his life to civil and social engineering, using Hill Valley as a prototype for tomorrow's cities today. That's where. Hi! Oh, a table. Citizen, Citizen Plus. Plus! Hi, Biff! Biff? Hey, well, you're, you're George and Lorraine's youngest. Martin, right? What? You don't know me? Only by reputation. Brown Cadet of the Month, three months running. Impressive. Huh. Are you interested in the Citizen Plus program? Nice, nice clothes. clothes. You lose a bed or something? Yeah. What do you mean? I'm wearing what everyone is wearing. It's Polo Shirt Thursday. You, my friend, are out of uniform. So I've heard. Yeah, well, there's always tomorrow. Hawaiian Shirt Friday. Great. Wow. Listen, Dave, that car I saw you get out of, was that Doc Brown in there with you? Ha! <laughs> Doc! Yeah, that should be his new nickname. But, but yeah, that was Citizen Brown. Mm. What an inspirational guy. How'd you get FaceTime with him? He seems so busy. Well, you got that right, Martin. Citizen Brown's a busy, busy guy. Busy, busy fortunately, guy. Fortunately, or uh, unfortunately, I'm a special case. Oh. See, Martin, I used to be a real bad apple. A real butthead. Oh? I don't see why that would make you a special case. What can I say, Martin? I was always getting into trouble. Into too much trouble. What with the booze, the party, and the women. Even my dogs were a pack of trouble. You pack, get it? Uh, yeah. What does this have to do <laughs> with Citizen Brown? Yeah, really. Well, after getting in so much trouble, the authorities, they took me in to see Citizen Brown and gave me an ultimatum. Citizen plus or bust. Bust? Do you think I could get to yeah, see really. Citizen Brown if I did all the bad stuff you used to do? Yeah, I guess, but why would you want to act like that? I don't know. M, they should have space pants Saturdays. Hell yeah. So, uh, but no one looks as good in space pants you as you do. do. Gosh, Martin, I, I really don't like dredging up the past, mm. but... Oh, yeah? Right, if it'll help you make a decision about Citizen Plus... Please. Tell me about the illegal you substances. You something about booze? Yeah. Beer, booze, rum, man. Whiskey, wine Beer, coolers, whiskey, wine coolers. You name it, oh. I drank it. Not only did I drink it, I smuggled it into Hill Valley, Smuggled too. into? Chip off the old block, huh? Used to be I'd knock your block off for a comment like that, but yeah, oh. I guess I was following in Pop's crummy footsteps. Where are you now? So there's no booze in Hill Valley. No booze? Nope. Uh, sure, someone tries to sneak some in every now and then, but cops like Officer Parker over there always catch them sooner or later. No booze? There's something familiar about that, huh? Why'd your dogs get you in trouble? Yeah. You weren't running dog fights, were you? No, nothing that bad. I just used to have a lot of dogs. What's wrong with that? Yeah, really. Nothing? Other than them keeping the neighbors up all night, lunging at old people, and eating all the squirrels in the park. Oh. In fact, I'm ashamed to say it was my out-of-control dogs that were directly responsible for the banning of dogs throughout No dogs? You don't sound very ashamed. No dogs? Oh, I am. Huh. 
very, very ashamed. Ah. Oh. What kind of trouble did you get into with women? Yeah. They weren't hookers? Oh, no, 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 nothing like that. It's just that I wasn't always discreet about my affections. You weren't discreet, what? huh? Public displays of affection, Martin. You know, necking and such. That's illegal? Oh, yeah. That's illegal. Yeah, let's let's change the subject. Yeah, I think I've heard enough. But what? Yeah, I don't like talking about my old nasty self. Oh? Public indecency? Yeah, totally. So you won't break any rules anymore? Hmm. Can't. The Citizen Plus treatment makes it physically impossible for me to break rules. What? How so? Yeah, really, how? How I get physically ill if I try to break a rule. How's your re-education holding up? Still incapable and uninterested in breaking the rules. Huh. How about a beer? Sure you aren't craving a beer? I do kind of miss beer. Oh, on second thought, bleh. Mm, wanna fight me? Used to be a real bruiser. But that's all behind me now. Okay. So what, you wouldn't even defend yourself? I don't know if I could, actually. Wuss. Oh, you're just aching to find out, though. Uh. Oh. <laughs> don't torment me. Poor, poor bitch. I can get used to this. No, please, Martin. Don't make me angry. All right, Biff. You're off the hook this time. Oh, my God. What is this Citizen Plus? Ask him what it's Citizen Plus is. Citizen Brown's new re-education program. Re-education program. The first of Hill Valley's Citizen Plus. Uh, pluses. Plus I? Oh. Tell me more. I want to know more about Citizen Plus. And I just can't wait to tell you yeah. all about it. Uh, did I mention the swell digital watch you get with the program? <gasps> digital watch? That's fancy. How do you... What do you got to do to be a Citizen Plus? Yeah. It starts with an application. They take a complete medical mm. evaluation and give you a stack of contracts to fill out. Uh, it sounds boring already. But then you get an appointment with Citizen Brown. Get about two years. Two years? He's very busy keeping Hill Valley running. Oh. I mean, the only time he deviates from his schedule is when some loony tune is running around racking up demerits. Fortunately, that almost never happens. Hmm. It's voluntary, right? Well, sure, for the pilot program, but eventually it will be mandatory. That should be mandatory. Oh, mandatory. Mandatory. Are you nuts? Man. Mandatory. I used to be nuts. Now, thanks to the Citizen Plus program, hmm. I'm probably the sanest guy in Hill Valley. I doubt that. Can I have the you watch? You said you get some sort of watch. Oh, it's a real classy deal. Just look at this state-of-the-art ticker. It's got all sorts of special modes programmed mm. in. I still haven't figured out how to set the time. But I'm sure a smart guy like you could do it no problem. So what's the mm. point of Citizen Plus? Well, it may not be as noticeable for an upstanding citizen like yourself, but the hypnotherapy sessions help to... Hypnotherapy. The to break the rules. Hypno... Whoa, whoa. Hypnotherapy. Therapy. Well, sure, Martin. Why, it makes obedience automatic. Obedience? This is some kind of brainwashing? Well, that's a good way to think about it. Scrubbing all those nasty thoughts right out of your noggin. It's not quite what... Never okay. mind. Let's it's not quite what it Citizen means. Plus that's right cool now. to know. Okay. So cool. later, Biff. Yeah, I think that's Bye, enough. Martin. What's Jen up to now? Hmm. <clears throat> what is Jen up to? That's a good question. I'm looking at one of self tours, but who cares? Citizen reading room. I guess there's one in every town. A citizen reading room. Wow. How exciting. Also, oh, that's his All bank. citizens bank. I don't like the overuse of the word citizen in this timeline. Really? Why not? Soup. Hey, can't you read? Oh, it's you, McFly. Leech? Hey, hey, my bad. I should have wrote the sign in Latin, just so you'd understand. What sign? 
outway to Unchle. Now eat it, ah. Bane, and let me catch some Z's. Wow. Oh. Okay. That was exciting. Oh. Must be where Jen keeps her paints. Locked. Hi. Jennifer. Jen. You got a problem? Maybe. What's the deal, Jennifer? He left me stranded outside the city gates. Yeah, that was pretty rotten, wasn't it? I'm such a horrible role model. Mm -hmm. Better get away before I corrupt <clears throat> you. Look, I don't know what you got against me in this timeline, uh, lately, but I'm here to make things right. I've missed you, you know? Take a look at me, Martin. Do I look like the kind of girl that would hang around the president of the Junior Brown Brigade? Oh, God. I don't know what the hell you're talking huh. about, but I gotta admit, I kind of like you like this. Uh, Barf? We're meant for each other. Turn off, but I don't buy it. We were meant to be together. Look, just yeah. because I let you tag along to a couple of concerts doesn't mean we're Romeo and Juliet. I mean, sure, you're a little cute, but you're into all this honor student crap. Oh. Honor student? And I'm into more interesting things. And guys. If you're going out with someone else, I bet I can make you forget them. Sorry, Martin, but you uh -huh. just don't rate anymore. Oh, snap. If you're going out with someone else, oh. I bet I can make you forget them. Sorry, Martin, but you just don't rate anymore. I just did that. Breaking the rules. Most of your time vandalizing public Yeah, most of time vandalizing don't private. Don't even think mm -hmm. about snitching on me. Unless you want this spray can up your... No, no, listen, you got me wrong. I'm looking to uh, break a few rules myself. Hell yeah. You? This ban on public yeah. displays of affection bites. Hey, you're talking about my most favorite legal infraction of all. Hey, yeah. that's lucky. Not you, ew. Not with you, ew, ow. This law against public kissing is a load of bull, right? Yeah. yeah. This town is full of it. What are you gonna do? Protest. That's what. Let's go stage a public kissing. Let's not and say we did. Yeah. Isn't graffiti a major infraction? You'd think, but after Big Brown had all those buildings coated in that Teflon polymer junk a couple uh -huh. years ago, graffiti's been knocked down to a two demerit offense. Go fig. Yeah. Okay. What do you know about harboring dangerous animals? Uh -huh. so you dangerous animals. Oh, lighten up. Do you know where I could score some forbidden materials? Do I strike you as somebody who would possess illegal substances? Um. Kinda, yeah. And you yeah. strike me as somebody who would turn in somebody like me. Next topic. Never mind. I thought maybe I don't want to know any more about breaking the rules. Really? What are you painting? Leech and the whoosh bags. I've never heard of them. No, you wouldn't have. They don't play much punk on those smooth jazz stations you listen to. Smooth jazz? I couldn't possibly be that square, even in an alternate timeline. Yeah. So, Jennifer. What do you think of the uh -huh. other me? What do you think of me? I don't. Ow. Seriously, what have you got against me? I'm kind of popular, right? Very popular. Among a certain crowd. What crowd? Ow. Dorks. Dorks? Marty McFly a dork? It's impossible. He can't be a dork. Okay, anyone who talks about himself in the third person is a dork. Hmm. Did you get a load of Biff Tannen back there? He's so... Calm. Yeah, creeps me out. You and me both. If that's what the Citizen Plus program's all about, I'll stay a Citizen Minus. Oh, I get it! What do you know about the Citizen the Plus, Plus program? program? Yeah, really. Only what I hear on TV, and the radio, and the newspapers, and the PA systems all over town. They want everybody to Yeah. Me, and they say it'll make us all happy and well-adjusted. Which is why I'm going to stay clear of it. Smart. Hill Valley's totally screwed up, but I got a plan to fix everything. You do, huh? I'm going to go talk to Citizen Brown and get him to make it all better. That sounds like the kind of plan you'd come up with, weirdo. Weirdo. 
Any chance my parents are still normal? Dad. What about them? Would you say they're normal? By Hill Valley standards, yeah. In other words, they're warped beyond repair. Oh. Sorry to be the one to break it to you. Hmm. Citizen Brown is a really great guy. You're wasting your breath, Martin. I don't buy into all that happy talk. No, really. This crazy police state wasn't his idea. It'll all get undone once I have a good talk hmm. with him. You know, I almost huh. feel sorry for you. Almost. It won't be long before I see Citizen Brown. Hey, can I come with you? You want to see Citizen Brown too? Yeah. No. Maybe he can give me a heart when he gives you a brain. Couldn't hurt to ask. Give me a can of spray paint. I got an urge to paint something. Happy little trees. Get Happy little trees. I don't get it. My wall. Bob Ross reference. Yeah. I'm going out with someone else. I bet oh, I can make you forget. Never mind. I heard Sorry, that one. Martin, but you just don't read hmm. anymore. Apparently, the I get nothing. Starting a streak. Ah. Huh. Lock. Shit. Junk. That junk looks awfully familiar. Fifty years familiar. Fifty years plank. I don't want to go digging through the trash unless I absolutely have to. Can I walk up the plank? Nah, that's just silly. How do I? Huh. That leads to the soup mo. Leech is in there. I'd rather he come out here. Rick door. Oh, I know what's down the there. Entrance to the old speakeasy. Yep, the old speakeasy. Hmm. Mm hmm. I look a wall. Let's see. What can we do? I know there's hints. I should probably read the hints. Huh? Probably be more helpful. What do you think? Read the hints? Helpful? Probably. Okay, cutscene. Oh. God, what happened to her? Mom? Hmm. Mart! Oh, hey, hey, Mom. Oh, no. So, what? what are, you... are you out here shopping or something? Shopping? Shopping? Poof! Who shops anymore? No, it's that time of the month for me again. Uh... For my civic duty. I'll be polishing the statue all day. Oh, right. Oh, God! What's with the golf cart, Mom? Now, Martin, I know you're embarrassed to be driving around in last year's model, but... Last year's model? ...the 86s yet. Uh, what about my truck? No one owns a truck in Hill Valley. Martin, are you sure you're feeling He lost okay? his truck! Yeah, yeah, I just... I must have had a really vivid dream last night. Well, mm. I hope your dream world was more fun than this one. Could you do more fun favor? than this one? Did you hear I that? Uh-huh. I forgot to give my father my timesheet for last week, and now Mr. Nosy is convinced that I'm hiding something from him. Timesheet? Aren't they annoying? <sighs> But Citizen Brown always says uh -huh. a scheduled life. Eighty six is a yeah, this game takes place yeah, in nineteen eighty six. Could you be a deer and drop it off at the house? Here, take the car. Actually, I I know, uh, I know, dear. Love you too. I'd give you a kiss, but you know what that gets you. Don't forget to pick me up this evening. Uh yeah, sure. Sure. Okay. This is exciting. Let's go home. Well, uh, it's not the truck, but I guess it'll do. Yeah, it's a golf cart. That's really all it is. It's slightly... No, I say fancier, but I don't really call that fancier. Uh... Huh. There's a lot of cameras everywhere. Isn't this illegal? What isn't illegal in Hill Valley? Don't worry, nobody can see us here. He's a peeping Tom. He's a peeping Tom. Oh, okay. Try to I'd rather a truck than a golf cart. I'm pretty okay? sure most people would. I don't. I don't like Trey hey, guitar. Hey, what's my guitar doing out here? Your mother and I convinced you to give it up. Remember? Rock and roll music is frowned on by the Brown administration. It sets a poor example for all the kids who look up to you as a model of studiousness and moral gravity. And besides, 
You're not very good. What? Come on, Dad. I need that guitar. Give me one good reason why I should give it back to you. Because... Music is good for you. It improves your mental performance. Yeah. Then take up the piccolo. Leave the electric guitar to the rebels and malcontents. But rock and roll is my destiny. destiny. Um, uh, destiny. Density of uh, destiny. destiny. What would you know about destiny? Now quit fooling around and get back to your studies. Wow. A certain girl is only gonna like me if I can play the guitar. Mm. A certain girl? You don't mean Jennifer? Oh, Martin. Why are you fixated on that little Helen? Mm. She's nothing but trouble. Yeah, my kind of trouble. And besides, the way you play guitar, you're only gonna drive her further up. Go ahead, son. Do your worst. Yeah. Thanks, Dad. You're only gonna drive her away, though, man. It. Not better than you realize. I love floppy disks. Readings programs. LeBrock 2.0. Anatomical constructs mm. for sciences of all sorts. <laughs> Boring. Yeah, really. Nice. We didn't have a computer in the other timeline. I. Uh. uh well, no joystick. That's lame. George or Dan? Um, I saw Mom downtown. She told me to give this to you. Thanks. Yeah. Say, uh, what gives around here? Ah, uh, you know, the usual. Keeping tabs on Hill Valley through my trusty bank of monitors. Always on the lookout for some interesting footage. Interesting? What do you mean, interesting? Yeah. What kind of silly question is that? I've been gathering candid documentary footage for Citizen Brown's promotional videos for over a year now. I know your mother doesn't approve of my work, but... Wait a minute. You say you saw Lorraine? 11 to 12 hair salon, 12 to 12 20 lunch at soup mow counter, mm -hmm. cream of asparagus with crackers. What was that? You know your mother's problems. If she slips up again, it could mean demerits for the whole family. There she is, polishing the statue in the park. Just like the schedule dictates. Oh, then everything's fine. Good. Unless... How was she when you spoke to her? Lucid? Sober? Lucid. Dad, you are way no. off here. Mom isn't a... Shh. I don't know for sure that your mother has relapsed into her old ways, but she's been acting mm. very odd lately. Odd. Almost as if she didn't like my constant supervision. No shit! Confidentially, I suspect she's really? got a flask hidden somewhere. Probably very near the spot where she's working right now. Do me a favor, son, will you? See if you can worm the truth out of her. She won't confide in me, but she may be less guarded with you. Double rations this week if you help your old man out. What do you say? That's a good boy. Okay, Dad, we need to talk. Yeah, that's just weird. What were you hiding when I came in just now? Yeah. Hiding? I don't know what you're talking about, son. You don't know? Come on, I saw it. It was a videotape, right? Um... I might as well tell you. After all, you'll be 18 soon. Tell me what? Hill Valley under Citizen Brown is not quite the contented town you were led to believe it was. Who'd have thunk? You're, You're kidding. kidding! This isn't a criticism of the great man himself, of course, or his sainted wife, Edna. No Ew, one's Edna. worked harder than they to apply the most advanced social planning techniques to our municipality. But... But... What? Confidentially, not everybody appreciates it. A great many citizens, perhaps mm -hmm. even the majority, actively resent the Brown administration. Oh. They don't say so publicly, of course. But in private? Well, just listen. I tell you, Bert, this regime is a joke. They're all laughing at us over in Fairfax. No. A toast to Citizen Brown. They have beloved courthouse. Struck Be by struck by lightning, 1955. You're awful. Mm -hmm. Are you coming to the town square, Lester? Citizen Brown's about to give another speech. Citizen Brown can kiss my hairy. Well, you get the idea. Yeah. yeah sounds like people yeah. can't stand with the Browns. You Brown's get the idea. Valley. Not everyone. Only around 50%, maybe 60. Mm -hmm. Does Citizen Brown know? He should. Whenever I send copies of my raw footage to the public relations department over at the courthouse, I get a memo telling me how much Citizen Brown thanks me for my service. But how could he see those videos and not do anything about it? Maybe you should take your tapes directly to Brown. Yeah. Oh, I don't know about that. I mean, sure, he might appreciate my bringing mm. these problems to his attention and reward me for my public service, but then again, 
They say it's never wise to be the bearer of bad news. Wow. Oh. I'll take the tapes, Citizen Brown. Why don't you Brown? give me those videotapes? I'll take them to Citizen Brown. Yeah. Thanks for offering, son, but I don't want to get you involved. Oh. Citizen Brown won't like what he sees on them, and I wouldn't want you to get the brunt of his displeasure. Not to uh -huh. mention the displeasure of all the folks on the tapes. Once they find out I recorded them... No, I'm uh -huh. not letting these tapes out of my sight. It's too dangerous. Oh. Okay. It's about mm. Mom. How'd she get to be such a mess? This isn't how she is in my... in my perfect world. You're right. It's a real puzzle. Because, of course, we both know uh. Hill Valley is a perfect world. No, it's not! For some peculiar reason, the harder I try to get her to conform to the rules, the more she slips up. Hmm. She's thinking about signing up for the Citizen Plus program. Is she now? You're not gonna let her go through with it, are you? Well, from what I hear, it's a fairly drastic procedure really? which completely reshapes the subject's personality. On the other hand, if Citizen Brown recommends it, it's gotta be a good thing. Probably not a good thing. I don't know. What do you guys think? I think it's a good thing, no? Can't you back off? Mom would be a little yeah, more really. Relaxed <laughs> if you gave her just a little bit of space. A little now, bit more space. That's a fine suggestion. What would Hill Valley be like if people gave each other space? Why, we'd all be tempted to follow our own impulses. Oh, and no. no telling where that might lead. Never mind. Mm. Mm. Something on your mind? It's about me. It's I'm about me. Yours. Well, uh, from certain things I've heard, I get the idea that people in this town regard Marty McFly as a... As a what? A nerd. They said that? In so many words. Mm. Just because a boy studies hard and gets straight A's and respects the rules and doesn't party or drink this is clearly or clearly a different and person than the Marty that we, that's in front of you. Obsessed with personal mm. hygiene and prefers his rubber band collection Stop. to. I really don't want to hear anymore. Yeah, really. I'm proud of you, son. Oh God. I'm trying to understand why Jennifer broke up with me in this time. I recent past mm. are you still mooning over that girl forget her mm. she's bad mm. news why my surveillance cameras have caught her doing things that that are completely against the hill valley code i don't want to know kissing boys sitting with boys in cars <gasps> i've kept quiet about it for her father's sake but believe me you're well rid of her well rid of nerd says chancellor nerd mm, uh nerd. is there anywhere you expect me to be like right now well, I did expect you to be up at the lake until tomorrow with that math and magic competition, so I guess your time is pretty much your own right now. Okay. okay different subject. Yeah. So. so about you and your, uh, work. Yeah. You seem to be really into this spying business. Spying it's business? It's not spying, son. It's cinema verite. No, it's These spying. These moments of Hill Valley's residents will eventually Anyone else be agree? compiled and Pretty edited sure into the spying. documentaries and promotional materials mm -hmm. that advertise our way of life to the rest of the world. True. Okay. You can argue that I've taken things to extremes, <clears throat> but I still get up to take my meals and, of course, to use the facilities. Wow. You're supposed to be, I mean, wouldn't you rather spend your time writing, say, science fiction novels? Yeah, really. Science fiction. I did mess around with it once, but that was before Citizen Brown made it illegal. Science fiction's illegal? Wow. Sci-fi promotes an unhealthy obsession with the fantastic and impossible, and it encourages the idea that there might be. So this is basically almost the exact opposite valid, world. Which is subversive nonsense. <laughs> what we have of course. before. My God, this is weird. Okay, different subject. Yeah, different subject. Yeah. It's about someone we both know. <clears throat> yeah. Yes? Have you seen Biff lately? Have you seen Biff lately? Since he went to the reconditioning center. Huh. Is he back among the living? Depends on what you mean by living. <clears throat> He's really different from the way I remember him. Mm -hmm. Lucky dog. In a way, it isn't fair that Hill Valley's biggest scoff law should be the first to receive yeah. the benefits of the new Citizens the Plus benefits? program. But I know I shouldn't be jealous. Mm -hmm. Have you ever spent time with Citizen Brown? Well, of course I'm in the audience for every one of his public addresses. One-on-one, -on -one, I mean. Oh, no. He'd never notice a common Sector L citizen like me. But I dream that 
that someday he'll recognize me for my public service. Public service. Maybe let huh. me shake his hand. <sighs> well, at least he doesn't sit on a toilet and have a fridge slash freezer and microwave next to him. Then have his wife stock. Well, considering the wife is what the alcoholic. I mean, what do you think? Mrs. Citizen Brown? Oh, she's a wonderful woman. People just think of her as this sweet, self-effacing, grandmotherly type. Edna? Are we talking about the same? But really, she's just as involved in running the town as her husband is. Really? Uh, David and Linda. Have you heard from them? No, I thought maybe you had. <sighs> Not in ages. As far as I know, he's still working for the big city newspaper, oh. and she's still in that women's boarding house. I'll never understand why they decided to leave Hill Valley. Why would hey, you leave Hill Valley? I don't know why you'd ever home. leave, but wait a minute. Hill so. Valley has a lot of rules. A lot of rules. It certainly does, for yeah. our own good. Public kissing is illegal, right? Ah, oh, the old PDA law. Indeed it is. And what's more, violation carries a hefty load of demerits. <gasps> but you know, it's a law people break with surprising regularity. Why, I could show you videotaped evidence. How exactly do people get other people to break it? On second thought, perhaps I shouldn't mm. show you the videotaped evidence. No. Okay. If I got caught with a contraband item, I'd get in a lot of trouble, right? You certainly would. You could be facing up to a thousand demerits, depending on a the... thousand life. demerits? But of course, you wouldn't be caught dead with anything illegal. It's your mother I'm worried about. Hmm. Did you ever harbor a dangerous animal? Aha! Couldn't if I wanted to. They've all been banned. But I did catch something very mm -hmm. interesting on one of my monitors yesterday. Which one was it? Oh, yes. Does that look like a stray dog to you? Whatever it is, Edna's Animal Patrol will make short work of it. Wow, that's just weird. Hmm. Something that's on your mind. very weird. What's the deal with the house, Dad? Yeah. I don't know how to tell you this, son, but while you were away at your mathematic competition, our house got slapped with a CZ-36 violation. Not a CZ-36! Well, I know, it's so embarrassing. Your mother's mortified. She works so hard to keep a clean house, but those dust mites are so hard to keep down. Are you kidding? Wait a minute, we can't go into the house because of dust mites? Well, not until they send in the cleanup crew. This is ridiculous. Thank goodness they let me move my office out here into the garage. Seriously? What? How exactly does this setup work? I'm glad to see you taking an interest. Each of these monitors mm. is connected to multiple cameras, of which I've strategically jacked into throughout the valley, with official clearance, of course. I can switch between cameras with these buttons. There's also a VCR for each monitor. Mm. I keep a record of everything I see. So, if I happen across something intriguing, I can keep it on file. Well, I'll leave you to your snooping. Supervisor. That was a Supervisor. lot of talking. Holy I'll crap. Leave you to it. Right. Is that, is that it? Oops, wrong button. Wrong button. Hold on. We need a hint. I remember having something. She might open up. She had a little privacy. George is spying all around with that camera by the statue. If only you could reach the camera to block it. Okay, so we got to go back to the town square. Squawk box. Squawk. No problem, citizen. Uh, everything's perfectly all right now. We're uh, we're fine. We're all fine now. Thank you. Uh, how are you? Yeah, that's Star Wars reference. Uh, where's the... How do I... That's what I was looking for. Let's go! Let's go back to Town Square. We gotta block the camera somehow, I think. That's the goal! Goal! Uh, okay. Hello. Mom? Hi. Uh, Mom, are you uh, drinking again? Don't be silly, dear. Booze is illegal, you know. Yeah, Mom. It's just that Dad mentioned... Your father. Why, I just can't get away from his prying eyes. Yeah, always really. Always spying, always watching. 
You, you mind your own business, George. Yeah. Rain, this is for your own good. I know you're keeping a secret from me. This is just mine creepy. to keep. <laughs> Dad, Mom, knock it off, you two. Yeah, really. Now you listen here, young man. This is an adult matter between your mother and me. Dad, I know, but your way isn't working. You got to give her some space here. Huh? Hmm. Where'd she go? Mom? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! What is that in your hand? Rum? Gin? A wine cooler? Totally, a whole wine cooler. It's brass cleaner. I have a job to do here, you know. Oh my god. No! Lorraine, I'm just trying to look out for you. You know the kind of trouble we can get into if you're huh. drinking again. Hold on, uh-huh. All right, let's see. You can, with a little effort, reach parts of the statue. Swing the mobile around so you're blocking the app. George, I wouldn't be so on edge if you weren't suffocating me all the time. Hmm. Does that do the trick? What's the problem, citizen? Yeah, I'll have a double-double animal style with fries and a diet. That's it. It's called an emergency intercom for a <laughs> I'm wrapping you for an SCR 300. Take your demerit print out before you go. Who cares? Mom? Hello. Did I move far enough? I'm on your side. If you got a problem, I want to help. But this is a choice you got to make yourself. Oh, look at you. You're such a sweet boy. I'm so glad you take after me rather than your father. Right? What, Lorraine? What? Ugh, I can't live like this! Dad, you're not helping. Oh, but I disagree, Martin. It's important that I catch her in the act so I can get it on tape. Once it's on tape, I can show her that she has a problem. Wow! That's ridiculous, Dad. That is ridiculous! Like is kind of sting operation. Yeah, really. Huh? Where'd she go? Mom? Aha! Yeah. Uh -huh. I knew it. There. What? Damn it. Okay, I'm trying to skip Jump it. Up. That was some sort of fruity liqueur. It's a spray bottle of simple orange for the cleaning I'm trying to do. Oh, snap. Probably have to Lorraine, hit it again. I'm sorry. It's just that you're acting so cagey lately. Cagey? Maybe mm. I'm a That's much. Uh, what happened? What the heck am I looking at? Yes. Ha. Yeah. Where'd she go? Yeah. Uh, there we go. Hi. Mom, now the dad isn't watching. Oh, Martin. Uh, <clears throat> I saw flask, that, Mom. Flask? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I, I. Look, it's okay, Mom. Get a hold of yourself. Yeah, really. Oh, your father's right. I'm backsliding. <laughs> but it's been so hard. What with your brother and sister leaving, oh. and then your father getting obsessed with his monitors, and oh. <laughs> and it says, "Wah." Let me take care of the flask. Yeah, oh, gee. Sometimes the subtitles are very little. <laughs> Off, which is always fine amusing. <clears throat> oh, thank you, sweetheart. I couldn't bear the thought of facing your father over this. I will take that. This timeline sucks. Mom and Dad are fighting again. Mom's drinking. It's like everything Doc and I ever did to fix things is falling apart. Yeah, that's an understatement. Attention. What do I gotta do? Alright, bad boy, you've got the booze now, you just need to get caught. Yeah, okay. I was going to tell. Alright, yeah, I was like, I've been feeling I have to talk to the police officer, but I'm like, you know, instead of me wandering around but getting the wrong person, I'd rather just double check. Also, wish I could run. My god, it's that walk is so awkward. Look at how he walks. So where the hell is the car? There he is. Hi. Hands up, citizen. Assume the position. 
Here goes nothing. Oh no, I'm gonna have a flask! There better be apple juice in this. Well, why don't you open it and find out? Yeah. Don't get smart with me. <clears throat> yeah, I knew you were no good, McFly. Officer Parker, what seems to be Ew, the problem? Ew, Edna. Citizen McFly, ma'am. Came strolling up with a 181B violation in his pocket. Oh, no. Ugh. You, young citizen, where did you get that? That booze? Nowhere. Is he being smart with me? Yeah, he played that attitude on me as well. Could we just fast forward the lecture and just get this over with already? No. Officer, demerit uh. him severely. And as for the alcohol, drop it into the decycling bin. With pleasure, ma'am. Hmm. Now, keep your nose clean, or you'll find yourself in front of Citizen Brown. Oh no, not in front of Citizen Brown. What am I ever gonna do? Alright, if you're looking for the last hug in Hill of Hell, you'll need something. I remember. I have 15 game point intervention. Get caught with Lorraine's booze. Uh, there's only one place in town vending any kind of food. Um, talk to the clerk and see if you can't get yourself a free sample of something tasty. To a dog, at least. Okay, so I gotta walk across. Just gotta walk across this. I guess talk to the dude somehow. Get some food. Maybe his lunch break's over. I don't know. Hi, Biff. Bye, Biff. What if, like, the cycling bin goes to Doc's office? It probably does, because that's actually, uh, funnier than anything else. Um, does this still say out to lunch? Soups and more. Wholesome soups, fresh vegetables, and soy-based imitation meats. Yeah. Well, good thing I'm not hungry. Hmm. Okay, uh... okay. Welcome to Soup Mo, where soup is just... Oh. It's Hi. Me. Also, I saw this that. better be important, McFly. Leech, was that Jennifer? Well, A, it's none of your business, and B, seeing as she ain't your chick no more? Yeah. Okay, now this timeline is really pissing me off. What's on the menu? Soup. Just soup? And more. Soup. More? Well, falls under the more category. We got neat loaf. It's made with textured wheat protein. Yeah. Uh, no thanks. <clears throat> what else uh, falls under the more category? Yeah. Well, there's the hum burger. It's made from pressed roasted hummus. You have any real meat back there? Define real. Anything I'm edible? afraid to ask, but what other non-soup food do you have? Anything mm -hmm. edible? Well, we have Needle. seems pretty neat. Yes, soy totally. Cheese hot dogs. They're new, and we're offering free samples. You want one? Sure. Where are the free samples? Here. I keep them behind the counter. Bet you oh, was... God. If you puke, you're cleaning it up, wuss. God, that looks disgusting. I, I can't finish this. Not my problem. Why are the samples behind yeah. the counter? I can't leave them out, dude. There's a DOG running around town, and he keeps oh. going after the sample tray, knocking them all over the ground. Aha! Uh -huh. A dog? Wait, these samples haven't been on the ground, have they? Jeez, McFly, relax. They're fresh, mostly. Huh. About this dog. Yeah, about this dog. What's he look like? Beats me. He's a smart little SOB. He only comes around when my back is turned. Aha! Uh -huh. How do you know it's a dog? You can smell him? Allergies, dimwit. Huh. What are those things? Those are the liver and peas with soy cheese uh -huh. hot dogs. Ew. You and me both, brown noser. Never mind. What's with this sneeze? cold or something? Ugh. Oh. Allergies. I swear, there's a dog hanging out around here somewhere. A dog? Yeah. Mm. And this stupid mutt keeps trying to steal my free samples. Yeah, I heard that already. Free, uh... 
you sure there's a dog around here? Listen, smart boy. There's only two things I'm allergic to. Dogs and disco. Disco. I don't hear no chicka bow wow, do you? No. no. Then it's a dog. Okay. See ya. Smell you later. It's... Hey, hey, there's that mangy. <coughs> Go get him, McFly. Okay. <laughs> Dog was this way. Also, I bet you it's Einie Einstein. Da ha. Well, first things first. I'm gonna. Eh. Grab that. Hmm. Um. Hmm. That leads to the soup, Mo. Leech is in there. I'd rather he come out here. No shit. Brick! It's just another brick in the wall. Ah! Another brick in the wall! Get it? Not interested. Uh, He's gotta be hiding hmm. in here somewhere. Huh. Bridge. Stay put now, boy. Wherever you are. Ah. Not a sign of him. Son of a bitch. Where'd he go this time? Hmm. Well, I'm glad the thing tells me what to do. Grab the spray paint. Spray paint the plank. It would look better blue. Yeah. That totally... That's totally what he did. And why are you throwing it away? That's contraband. Okay, so we need to get the dog to come back there? Hold on. I don't want to go digging through the trash unless ah. I absolutely have to. Okay, so let me go back over there. So we have to go grab the dog again, free samples, get the dog over, or something, yada yada, blah 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 blah. <sighs> boy. Hmm. Oh, never mind the free samples. Huh. Heh. <laughs> I think that worked. What do you guys think? Are the hints any different? You never be able to guess. Caution my paint is for black. Yeah, okay. I got this. I'll get the dog. I'll find the doggy. Come here, doggy, 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 doggy. There. Now we're in business. Hmm. What the hell did I do that for? I outsmarted you, didn't I? Ah, oh, don't be like that, Einie. It is Einie! Einstein, is that your name in this timeline too? <laughs> Guess not. Huh. Um. You Look, the Einie, food on him. I've got a treat for you. Atta boy. Now hold still. There. There is a tree. I'm not such a bad guy, right? <laughs> whoa, whoa, okay. I guess I've won you over. I wish they were all this easy. <laughs> I wish they were all this easy. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, there is some more progress. We've gotten the dog. We're, gonna, we're trying to make his main demerits to meet Citizen uh, Brown. What is it, boy? Yeah, man. Wait, yes. Wait, wait. No. Oh, rabies! Rabies! Help! Rabies! Back. Down! Shit! Play dead! 
Officer Parker, subdue that beast at once! Einstein, sit! Einstein? Oh, if he bites me, you'll be in a world of trouble, citizen. Okay, do it! Do it! Oh my... Wait, I know that creature. She knows that creature, I don't know why. That's the stray that keeps escaping oh. the kennel. I thought he was muzzled. I took the muzzle off. You what? That's right, he's my dog now. Citizen, you are in violation of statute 357K. Arca, demerit this hooligan at once. Hooligan! Oh, Anna, you evil creature. To evil. Yes, ma'am. Filthy, wretched beast. Mm. Don't worry, Aini. Once I fix all this, you'll be back with Doc and romping through time. I'll stay out of trouble. Unless you want a visit from Citizen Brown. That's better. Um, that's two merits. Oh. All good dogs go to Utah. What the frick? Does that even mean? Can't just Sarah and Jennifer. He's already got a good... No. Everybody needs to... Keep egging her and she'll put you two to the test. Jennifer is the one you want to impress her. Until you get her boyfriend out here for a... Okay. Alright, so we got... We got to do a, a guitar battle. A battle of the guitars. Oh, I got this. I got this. Hmm. There's a reason why I have hints turned on, because I need those. Oh my goodness, yes, yes, that quote, Pierce. That is some quote. It's amazing how she's made absolutely zero progress on it. Hmm. <clears throat> Hi. What is it now? Leech is a wasteoid. Come on, Jen. It's you and me. Yeah. Meanwhile, hey, hey fly, someone. You might have had a thing for about ten minutes, oh. but you're not even in the same league as Leech. Not in the same league? Oh. You and Leech, Jennifer? Hey, don't badmouth Leech. There's a lot more to him than soup, you know. Oh. Like what? For one thing, he wields an axe like nobody's business. Oh, yeah? So you guitar? Got a I play guitar. guitar. What can I say? Mm -hmm. I'm a girl who appreciates a hot lick. A hot lick? Yeah, I remember. Come on, Jennifer. Nobody in town plays guitar like me. I'm talking electric mm -hmm. guitar, Martin. I'm going to be honest, the ukulele has to go. Does it now? I can Man, I'll play your loser boyfriend, boyfriend any, any day of the day week. Of the week. You're that desperate to get to first base. Did you say first or fourth? I'd give fourth. you two and a half. Mm. But first you gotta prove you've got better fingers than Leech. You ready to throw down? I was born ready. I was born ready. Never leave home without it. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, here we go. You can knock on my door anytime. Hold it. We got company. McFly. What's that was doing here? He says he can outplay you. Oh god, he's got a booger. No one in Hill Valley. Oh yeah. Want to go prove it? The ring of rock. Don't crush him too bad. Just teach him a lesson. Oh. Meh. Scissor kick. Yeah, I'm scissor kicking it, all right. Flourish! Yes! Oh, yeah. I can give up. I'm gonna climb on a platform. Yes, I am so good. Woohoo! Oh, I hope that wood breaks. Uh huh. Climb down towards Jennifer. Oh yeah. I'm not sure how they're playing because they're not actually hooked up to the amp, but whatever. Move towards amp. The 
There's something I'm supposed to do. I'm not stupid, but I don't know what it is. Move to the left, maybe? I don't know. Hmm. Still the same stuff. I'm on platform, see what I can do up there. Oh, I think this occurred to me. I think I think if I do a the scissor kick, that might break the shit, he climbed down. Oh, okay then. I'm on the platform and stay up there! Bah! I'm gonna flourish! Alright, I gotta figure out something. There's something I'm supposed to do. Ha! Huh. Move to the right. Flourish. You cut my cord, you asshole. Wow. Somebody should have cut it a long time ago, McFly. The winner and undefeated champion of Hill Valley. What a jerk. Nice champ. Mm. Mm. <laughs> well, back to work. See you, loser. Shit. I can't believe you'd let him get away with that. He totally broke the rules. There are no rules hmm. in rock and roll, Martin. Wow. That's why a guy like you shouldn't compete. Do I have to do that over again? He's plays big and dirty. Maybe too big for his own good. And watch out, he cheats. Maybe he wouldn't be so good with his amp knocked over. Up on a precarious platform. That's what I was trying to do. Son of a bitch, I'll do that again. I bet you I can beat him. Yeah. I want a rematch. Yeah. Hey, you got nerve, McFly. You really want to be humiliated like that again? Maybe. Nothing but a poser. I got the technique. Do you now? Want a sample? Maybe. If you can beat Leech. Hmm. I already swatted you once, McFly. Shouldn't you be lying in the gutter? I was, hmm. but then your mom threw me out. What you say, my mother? Try not oh! to leave any stars, baby. Yeah. Let's try that again. First things first, I think it was the scissor kick to get him to knock over his amp. Yeah, okay, okay. Hmm. What'd you say about my mother? Yeah, right? He's like, how dare you? I'm gonna climb on platform. Why doesn't he just stay there? Why can't he just stay on the bloody platform? Like, seriously. Ha! Huh. Ha. Huh. Really? He's gonna cut mine again? God, son of a bitch. Yeah. Look towards Jennifer! Yep. Hey, you looking for a fight? Son of a bitch! One. I beat you. Again. Oh my mm. god damn it. Well, mm. that was fun. I'll see you later. Love is a battlefield. That's a song. Okay. If you can get at least knock over his own gonna have to get him to trip himself up on a precarious platform. What the fuck do you think I'm doing? Yeah. Okay. Yeah? We 
Leech might think he's got chops, but I invented rock and roll. Ooh, nice axe. Your mommy buy that for you. Let's try this again. Why do I have to again? do? What can I say? I'm a glutton for punishment. A glutton. And he shall feast. Whoa. To the victor go the hickeys. Let's try that again. The obvious thing is the scissor kick, so he knocks off his amp. Or knocks down his amp to knock down the... To knock down that. But now what? Hmm. Flourish! Wow. I'll move to the left! <clears throat> hmm. I know what I have to do. Well, I mean, I have to get him on top of the plank and him do something on the plank. I'll find out what it is! Flourish again? I have no idea. Hmm. Son of a bitch, he's going towards my amp again. Flourish, hey, boo! Yep, he cuts it out again. Son of a hey, bitch! You looking for a fight? We just God had one. I beat you again. Hmm. Mm. Yeah. Well, that was fun. I'll see you later. Love is a battlefield. Love is a battle. Let's try this again. <sighs> yeah? Uh, Each okay. might think he's got chops, but I invented rock and roll. Ooh, nice axe. Your mommy buy that for you. Looks hmm. like someone can't take crushed for an answer. No? Let's try this again for the millionth time. Yeah, I got the first part down. Hmm. Aha! I'm on the platform. Maybe he'll stay there. Let me do something. Cause then he's on the... Cause he's an idiot. Seriously, stop climbing off! Uh, let's try that again? Did I just keep trying to climb on the platform until it just like let me do something else? Cause that would be nice. And he climbs off. Seriously, can you not? Ah, son of a bitch. I'm on platform again? So lets me do something? Because clearly that's what I'm supposed to do, but then they just walk right off. If they didn't... There you go. There we go. I think there you go. Finally! Jesus Christ. Yeah, now hop, you idiot. There. Get wrecked. That's more like it. Martin McFly. That y was Yeah, Bo, I know I needed to stop on the totally platform. Awesome. But I kept what walking I off. Say? I was like, why am I Some supposed to do it? No, I'm not beating the whole game <laughs> Some tonight. Guys don't. Just this episode. <laughs> you broke my head, Star. I am so sorry. Got no, a new idol. Come here. Oh, hey, you... I got a better idea. A better idea. What was it you hmm. called me? A square? A girl's entitled to make a mistake, isn't she? Oh, snap! Oh. Mm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> mm. Hooliganism! Delinquent! 
Oh, look at this! Oh, snap! I just caught these two degenerates violating statute number... Jennifer? Daddy! 476 D. Open mouths? And tongues. Oh, You've gone no! you too far, Jennifer. What's the big deal? It's only hormones. Stop! We don't use words like that Hormones? Oh, no. I'll deal with you later, young lady. We're gonna have to have a long talk about the Citizen Plus program. What? Oh, come on. Officer, give Mr. McFly a 476 D's worth of demerits. I'll tend to your wayward yes, daughter. Yes, ma'am. Oh, and no. this is for getting my daughter in trouble <laughs> with Citizen Edna. Now keep out of trouble. Or Citizen Brown will come down on you like a brick wall. Oh no! Not a ton of bricks! Hey, achievement. Seven minutes in heaven. Get caught making out with Jennifer. Hey, Jennifer. Hi. Are you still angry with me? Angry? Nah. The threat of being Citizen Plus was worth it just to see my dad's veins go all purple like that. Great. Because I gotta go. Jeez, Martin. What's gotten into you? Booze, dogs, necking in public? Right? It's like you're a different guy today. 15 more to points and you get the toaster oven. Guy. Yeah. I know this is going to be hard to believe, but I'm the same guy I've always been. It's everyone else who's messed up. And stop calling me Martin. It's Marty. Well, it's Marty. Marty. What's next on the agenda? Knocking over banks? Sure. Maybe. What's a guy got to do to get in trouble around here? I think you're about to find out. You, citizen. Mm. Get out of here, Hi. Jim. Not a problem. Are you Martin Seamus McFly? Maybe. Yes. We have a warrant for your detention. Detention? Detention? You've over 15,000 demerits in the past 24 hours. Cool. Is it? Young Mr. McFly is being branded as a criminal of weak moral character. Cool. I'm not weak. But you are in a heap of trouble. Hmm. Trouble? Oh my, yes. But don't worry, we're here to take care of you. Uh -oh. Like your Citizen Plus program took care of Biff. Oh, God. The program is in need of new volunteers. Hmm. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. First, let's see what Citizen hmm. Brown has to say about Citizen your particular Brown. strain of anti-social huh. behavior. You're taking me to Citizen Brown? Uh -oh. Immediately. Officers, away with him. Yes, yes ma'am. Ma away with it's him. time. It's about time. Eh. I always knew your goody two shoes A plus student act was too good yeah. to be true. Yeah. You think she might recognize Corleone from the first two episodes? Yeah, you'd think she'd recognize it, but I guess after all those years, there wasn't any pictures of Corleone. If there were pictures, what a name to pick, Michael Corleone. Mm, I wonder where that came from. I'm kidding, obviously. Hello. Oh my goodness, we get to meet Bra the Doc. Come in, citizen. Doc? Martin McFly, age 18, resident of Sector L, Father George, Mother Lorraine, mm -hmm. president of the Junior Brown Brigade, mm -hmm. recipient of a full-ride scholarship to Strickland College, winner of the Courthouse Challenge Department Award, zero demerits mm -hmm. until this morning. The obvious question, Mr. McFly, is... Is? Oh, God, he's what balding. You? You gotta believe me, Doc. I only did it to get your attention. Yeah. Interesting. You regard me as a doctor, indicating awareness that you're suffering from some variety uh, of mental disorder. Not quite what I meant by Doc. That's a hopeful sign, Martin. Of course, I'm not actually a doctor, but I do have the tools to turn you around and put you back mm. on the road to societal normalization. Shall we begin with a few questions to establish a baseline? Oh, God. Forget questions. You're the one who needs to turn around. Yeah. Explain. I know this is going to be hard yeah, to Yeah, I'm not supposed to in this timeline. I'm not from around here. I'm from a different timeline where Hill Valley isn't all, all screwed, screwed up and there aren't these crazy rules and, and my dad's not a snoop and my mom's not a drunk and, and you're my best friend in the whole space-time continuum. Yeah. An old fogey like me? Your best friend? Yes. And Doc, I need you to get me back there. So mm. you believe this interview is really more about me than you? Yes. You went to all this trouble just to deliver a message to me in person? Yeah. Yes. 
cry for help, as it were. Yes! No, wait. I have Tell me, Mark. Hmm. Is your mother on the sauce again? Not where I come from. When I left here, both my parents were yeah. happy and well adjusted. Okay, hmm. didn't start out that way. He thinks way, he is that's crazy, where no doubt. Time machine comes in. Time machine? Yeah, Doc, listen to me. You don't remember it, but you built a time machine out of a DeLorean. Why? Well, just for the hell of it, I, I guess. Plus, the steel frame of the DeLorean dispersal, I don't know. It was important for some nah. reason. Fascinating. Yes, yes, it is fascinating. It's it's amazing. It's incredible. But you don't know it because you've never invented it. You're not the real Doc Brown. you got to believe me. Not the real Doc Brown. And this is because? Everything got screwed up when I went back in time to 1931. Sounds like this time machine mm. is a very impractical and dangerous invention. Yeah, pretty dangerous. No, I, I mean, yes. What I mean is it's messed up a lot of things, but first, it made a lot of things better. Yeah. I like my mom and my dad. It was only thanks to your time machine that yeah. they ever became successful and happy. And happy. So happy. But they're not, because you summoned me back in time, and somehow your timeline got messed up. Everybody else is along with it. Yeah. I see. No, you don't. Think. Think back. Don't you remember me? We knew each other when you were 18. I'm Michael Corleone. Incredible. He this doesn't believe me. This more serious than I'd imagined. The boy has fabricated an yep. alternate reality. Saw that coming. Wish that me. simple. I wish I had fabricated it. Yeah. Calm down, Martin. I'm not blaming you for anything. The failure is ours, not yours. Oh. Obviously, there was a drastic flaw in your social conditioning. Yeah. I don't understand. No, I don't understand yet, but I want to. I want to get at the root of your problem. Oh. Keep talking. Ah. Uh, take your time. Look around the room. Perhaps something here will stimulate your map. Your memory. Hmm. I mean, Psst. check this out, Doc. Yeah, all your notes about the flux capacitor, your greatest invention. That can't be my notebook. The handwriting is far too sloppy. Well, shit. It's better if I keep this on me at all times. No shit on that. Oh. Okay, take a look at this picture of Einstein here. The dog harboring dangerous animals is a municipal offense. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, hmm. they told me. But you harbored this very same animal once, hmm. a long time ago. Remember the test run of your rocket car? Einstein landed on the roof hmm. of the courthouse. I do. I, I do recall something of the sort, but naturally it couldn't have been the same dog. No? There wasn't anything natural about it. Einstein's a time traveler, too. Thanks, thanks to, to your, your invention. invention. It's such uh, time traveling. Uh, what? Someone's confused. detailed illusion. Keep talking. Okay. The clock window. Wow, that is cool. The sound, it... Yeah, it's kind of lulling. Uh, right. Wait, what was I doing? Oh. The clock! That's the clock tower. That clock looks familiar. No oh, shit. Uh, movie ticket. You still got the movie ticket. Indeed I do. A memento of my first date with Edna. Oh. To go to see the virtuous husband. And you never saw Frankenstein. You were supposed to go see Frankenstein that night. It was going to give you the inspiration oh. you needed to pull off your big demonstration at the Hill Valley the Expo. The Hill Valley Expo? Inspired by Frankenstein. How whimsical. Not to mention historically inaccurate. Uh -huh. My dolly wife is all the scientific muse I've ever needed. From my successful demonstration at the 31 Expo all the way up to my cutting edge of Citizen Plus program. Successful? It was supposed to be a failure. Hmm. Monitors. He's it's watching. All the same stuff I saw on my dad's monitors. He's always Thank watching. You. The whole town is under surveillance. Huh. Okay, what do we got? We got a symbol. I can't tell if it's a guy celebrating a touchdown or chained up in a gulag. Glass half full, Marty. Half full. No, it's pretty half empty.
Aha, fish tank. Hey, this is your fish tank. Yes, that is my fish tank. Uh -huh. It looks much better without all the bacteria. Yeah. Edna just had it cleaned. Yeah, but in 1931, it was full of bacteria that we used to make rocket fuel. Rocket Remember? fuel! I, uh, bizarre fantasy life. Go on, proceed. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. File cabinets. Jeez, Doc sure has a lot of files. Yeah, that's a lot of files. I don't have time to go through those. I'll just... Focus on what's out on display. Okay. Put that. Pe uh, what the hell else is? What else is there? Aha! Uh -huh, portrait. So that's what Judge Brown looked like. I never actually never saw. Never actually saw. Tell you what he looked like. Hey, Lysander. Before you were born. Uh huh. My biggest supporter. NASA boy star. I haven't touched Minecraft to in. Last time I saw your younger self, you and your dad had just had a big uh, falling out over your decision to become an inventor instead of a lawyer. Isn't that right? Uh -huh. Stop trying to confuse me! My whole life has been dedicated to the uh -huh. practical use of technology to shape a more efficient, uh -huh. orderly society. That's totally how it goes. Ask anyone. It's a fact. So look it up. You know better, uh -huh. right? Emmett? I, I, wrong. <clears throat> Why? Uh -huh. This Krabby Patty may be over 9,000! Thank you for the host, Lysander. August you see this picture? 25th, I keep it 1931, uh -huh. the day I single-handedly captured Kitana, the scourge of Hill Valley. Single-handedly? And not incidentally uh. the day I caught the eye of Edna Strickland. My scientific muse and I've uh. my life. Take a look. What do you see there is a young man who understands his destiny. Huh. That's not what I see. Hmm. What do you see? Uh. Right there. I think it is. What? It's me and you, the other the you. The other you. Great Scott. It is me and you. But how? Michael? Michael, hi. It's impossible. No, it's science. It's your science, Doc. In this other world, the one you say you come from, am I? Am I happy there? Yeah. Very happy. You've got two great sons. Sons. Yes, and sons. a fantastic wife. Yeah. Not Edna. Not even remotely. And your invention, jeez, Doc, you can go anywhere you want to, anywhere in time. Anywhere in time. This guy in the universe. Hmm. And what about Hill Valley? Hill Valley. You know it's got problems. A little bit of urban decay here, a little bit of crime there. It's a normal city. People are oh. happy, mostly. And even when they're miserable, they're not miserable like they are in your Hill Valley. Stop! Huh. There are no miserable people in my Hill Valley. Give me a break. You don't really believe... My citizens lead lives of order and peace. Nobody worries. Nobody complains. Only because they're afraid to. Jeez, open mm. your eyes, will you? You and Edna have got him all huh. terrorized. That's Mrs. Brown to you, Sonny. Doc, kindly address me as your honor. Well, shit. Shit. We worked for over 50 years, my wife and I. Every waking moment devoted to Ridley Hill Valley of vice and disorder. Hmm. Do you dare to claim that our citizens are unhappy? Yeah. Yeah, I, I do. I've seen it. They're just too afraid to speak up. Yeah. Afraid? Afraid of what? Afraid of the consequences of their actions, Doc. You run this place like it's a police state. Not so yeah. I can prove it. All right, then, time travel boy. You do that. And until you do, I'm going to treat your wild story as just that. A story told by a madman. A madman. that the best treatment is simply to let the insanity mm. run its course. So, is the interview over? Should I leave? Please do. I'm very busy. I've got a city to run. Fine, but I'll be back with proof. Proof! The proof is in the pudding. Freaking head that was listening. I'll go get that proof. I can get that proof. I got this. Oh, yeah. 
Go home, get the proof, go back. Proof is in the pudding, as they say. Doc wants proof that Hill Valley mm. isn't the perfect place he thinks it is. <clears throat> One smoking gun coming up. Dad! Pop out the tape. <clears throat> Son, I think it's done rewinding. Uh -oh. Uh oh. Whoa, whoa, take it easy. Mm. Sit here. Guess I blacked out for a minute there. Fell out of my chair. Fell nothing. Ah. Somebody whacked you. Whacked me? <laughs> Impossible. We take great pride in the fact that incidences of physical violence in Hill Valley have fallen to virtually. Ah. Who did it? Can you tell me? This can't be happening. There's got to be a clue around here somewhere. The bat? Dead. That's not one of our bats, is it? Probably no. not. No. McFly's never used a Um, Chancellor, bats. this is the 80s. Curious. CDs don't exist in the oh, 80s. Wait, don't touch it. It's evidence. Of what? Oh, why would anyone do a thing like that to a nice Sector L citizen like me? I don't know. What's the last thing you remember? I was sitting right here, copying oh. another incriminating scene onto my my tapes. Because I know this should become a problem. I bet you. Stay calm, Dad. Oh, are they on the floor? Remember, you see Biff in a box was under mind things. control or something, brainwashed. I bet you mind control. I didn't use Biff to take him out to steal any evidence of people being unhappy. Here it is, raw footage. Thank heavens. Wait a minute. You see, I told you you were just jumping to conclusions. All these dark suspicions about thieves and attackers went all the time. It was just empty. What? There's no yeah. tapes. But I'm sure they were in there before. Before whoever it was whacked you in the head and took them. Oh my gosh, I've yeah. been mugged. Mugged in Hill Valley. They can't get away with it. Oh. Don't worry, Dad. We'll get to the bottom of this. Yeah. Who, who could have done this to me? Who stands to lose if those tapes get out? Yeah. Everybody who's bad mouth Citizen Brown when they didn't know a camera was on them. But that's half the people in town. Oh. No. I'm guessing this was a lone agent. Oh, it's no use. The tapes are mm. gone. All I can do is hope against hope they don't surface and land me in trouble. Come on, Dad. We can't just give up. I mean, maybe there's some more clues around here. Yeah, let's look for What's more clues. Use? Even if we find out mm. who took the tapes, we're not going to be able hmm. to get them back without attracting attention to ourselves. Attracting attention? There's got to be something we could do to get hmm. our hands on those tapes. Well, we can make new ones. We can? Sure. It may take a while, but if you're hmm. willing to help your old man out, it shouldn't take us more than, say, six months? Oh, God, Six no. months? But I need those tapes now. You need the tapes. Uh, what I mean is... Justice it's must prevail. The principle of it, you know, yeah. if you let the thief get away with his crime, it yeah. sets a bad example for other thieves. Yeah. You said you needed the tapes. I hate you feel you were. Your time is valuable. Yeah. I would hate for you to have to redo all that work. You said you needed the tapes. I'm worried for I'm your worried safety. Mother comes back. Yeah. Maybe bang on the head might do you in. You said you needed the tapes. Really? I gotta give it to Citizen Brown. I told him I was gonna furnish him with proof that Hill Valley isn't as happy as he thinks it is. When I was in his office. Just before I came here. Mm -hmm. You had an interview with Citizen Brown? It wasn't easy to get, believe me. I had to break all kinds of rules. Really? You've been breaking rules? Harboring stray dogs, kissing girls in public, getting caught with mom's flask. That is the most far-fetched story I've ever heard. It's true. You forget I'm your father. I know your history. Yeah, well, history's changed. Yeah, well, history Prove has it. changed. Yeah. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Uh, dude. Monitors. Very broken. The monitor's dead. No shit. The monitor's dead. The monitor's dead. The monitor's dead. <laughs> The monitor's dead. It's all dead. The monitor's dead. It's all dead. Okay, okay, here the we go. PR. A whopper. <laughs> I wonder what that stands for. Wait, what? Game Grid. Sweet. Ah, the movie was better, though. Game Grid. 
Hmm, I feel like it's uh, based off of something. Can I, I take should take this and serve a little payback. Could Second I... thought, cool your jets, Marty. What? I want to take it. No. No, he's not gonna take it. Hmm. Say. I'm telling you the truth, Dad. I've been breaking rules all over town. You'll have to convince me. Oh. Narp. See? Read him and weep. Demerits, but... It was the only way. I don't understand. Yeah. Listen to me. I mean, really listen. You and I both know that things aren't right here. Yeah. Citizen Brown might have started with good intentions, but his Hill Valley's just made everybody miserable. Uh -huh. You said that to him? Basically, yeah. Yeah. Oh, there go our privileges. No, wait. I got him to listen, Dad, and he's gonna make things right for you and Mom and all of us. Uh huh. I can't explain how. You're just gonna have to trust me on this. Trust me. Okay. I first, sense I have to show him your tapes uh -huh. to prove my point. Oh no, 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 Dad. This scheme of yours. Maybe you know what you're doing. I can't say. But leave me out Dad. of it. Dad, I don't like trouble. I can't handle it. It's not in my genes. Really? But. What for Do Arthur? For your father. My father? Yeah, Arthur McFly. I know his name. Didn't he have something to do with putting away Kid Tan and, you know, way back when? Yeah. Yes. Yes, he did. Where do you hear about that? It was way back before Citizen Brown cleaned up the town. Yeah, before really. I was even born. Were you even born? Everyone lived in terror of Kid Tan and his goons. But Dad hmm. stood up to him. He had evidence of Kid's guilt, see, and he risked oh. his life to deliver it to the authorities. Never be afraid to do the right exactly. thing. Exactly. Gotta do the right thing. And what are you doing? Trying to remember which is the right feed. Hmm. Feed to what? To the surveillance camera, the one in the yard. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You have a surveillance camera trained on yourself? Hmm. Of course. Gotta cover all bases. Now help me figure out which monitor I'm on. Huh. Okay, we'll look at the monitors. It says to keep this printout for my records. <laughs> oh, that jump scare didn't work. It says to keep this printout for my records. Oh, whoops. Nope. There we go. Hi. Let me get this straight. You captured huh. this whole attack on tape? Of course! Surveillance is what I do! Why didn't you say so in the first place? Come on, son! Stop dawdling and help me track down that feed! Try flipping the switches! There! Have a thousand points, everybody! What do you think I just did? Like, seriously! Huh. There. There. That looks like us. So the surveillance tape must be on this VCR. Aha. Uh -huh. This must be before the attack. Let's see. I remember cleaning the playback heads at 5.30. <clears throat> the attack couldn't have been very long after. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's Biff. But it can't be him. The Citizens Plus program has rendered him as gentle as a... Kitten. Huh? huh? Wow, that was like a tap. I can't understand it. That's not the way he's supposed to behave. Yeah, he did it anyway. Old Biff would hey, never. Wait, what's that weird flashing on his wrist? Aha! Uh -huh. Let's find out. I knew this zoom and enhance feature would come in handy someday. Cost zoom me a bundle. Well, shop. that's convenient. It's his digital watch. I wonder why it's doing that. Hey, wait, wait, stop the picture. Aha! Uh -huh. Zoom in anymore? X11. You know what that means? Not yet. Huh. Lorraine! Don't lay into me, George. <clears throat> I've got something mm. very important to say, and then I'm going to be leaving again. I've got something important Aww. to say, too. I was attacked it's and robbed. It's always about you, isn't it? You can't just wait and listen to my news. Oh, no. Oh. You have to go and beat me to the punch. Oh, jeez. That's right. You two sort things out. I've got some business to I attend to. I do have some business to attend to. Dun, dun, dun. Let's go. Is there enhanced? Why was the thing in real life? 
at least. I mean, yeah, you can zoom in real life, but enhance, that's not a thing, is it? Huh. And yeah, he'll have no idea what we're talking about when I go to ask him. I'm calling out right now. Biff! Biff! Whoa, whoa, settle down there, fella. You beat up my dad. Do we have a problem here, citizens? Oh, no, 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 officer, just a little misunderstanding. I'm sure we can work it out. Right, Mark? Sure. Sure. Okay. Let me know if you need any help, Mr. Tannen. Now, let's see if we can get to the bottom of this. Yeah, let's. Yeah, why'd you beat up my dad? Why'd you hurt my dad, Biff? Yeah. He never did anything to you in this timeline. Timeline? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb. I saw you on camera. But I can't hurt anybody. Thanks to Citizen mm -hmm. Plus, I blow chunks whenever I even think about doing bad stuff. Uh oh. 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 oh, oh. Mm. Uh, mm. See. And where's what the secret tape? Dad, secret videotape. Secret videotape? Yeah. Well, the one that shows how people are fed up with all these screwy rules and laws. You lost me, Martin. But that tape sounds dangerous. It should probably be dumped in the decycling bin. Uh huh. If you didn't beat up my dad, then where have you been for the last couple of hours? Well, I was. Uh, I was. <gasps> what? That's strange. I don't remember. Why don't you remember? What is the last thing you remember? The last thing you remember before your memory loss. Well, I was handing out flyers for the yeah? Citizen Plus program, just like I'd been doing all day. All the time, okay. I just finished feeding some leftover bologna to a cute little squirrel when Miss Edna came by. Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. Yeah, she wanted to run a, a diagnostic on my Citizen Plus watch. Aha! Uh -huh. I must have fallen asleep or something, because when she was done, it was an hour later. And then your mom came by. Hmm... So the last thing you remember before my dad got beat up is Edna fiddling with your watch? Uh-huh. Yeah, that does sound pretty bad, doesn't it? Let me see your watch. Your watch. Does X-11 mean anything to you? X-11? Is that a new band or something? Yeah, I don't go in for that new hippity-hoppity stuff. It's not a band, Biff. No? It's a mode on your Citizen Plus watch. Weird. I I've never seen it look like huh. that. Jack, I can barely get this thing to stop blinking. See? Wow. Cool. I didn't know you could do that. X11, huh? My wrist is getting a little sore. How do I make it do it? Oh, wait a minute. Yeah! X11! Uh, 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 okay, that's uh, weird. What's wrong with, wrong with you? Uh. Where's my dad's tape? Uh. The decycling bin? Uh. Could you do me a favor and go get my dad's tape? Yeah. Uh. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, Mr. Tannen. What's up? Uh, uh. Is that McFly kid bothering you? Uh, hey, uh, you can't go in there. Hey. Uh, 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 I'm good at this, aren't I? Whoa. Uh, uh, holy smokes. W what happened to him? I don't know. No one's ever jumped into the decycling bin before. Whoops. Well, where does it go? That huh. information is above my pay grade. Oh, jeez. I'm in a lot of trouble now. A lot of trouble, Don't you move say. A muscle, McFly. I gotta go tell Citizen Brown about this. <clears throat> okay. I've got a really bad feeling about this. Well, here goes nothing. Whee! Where are we? Hmm. Gosh, ma'am, did I do something no. wrong? To the garbage did chute, I McFly. Do oh. something, Mr. Tannen. I put a lot of work into uh. homing you as the first Citizen Plus. What on earth huh. possessed you to assault a police officer and dive headfirst into the decycling bin? Did I do all that? Lord, I thought your father was dim. 
No, mm. really. I don't remember doing anything like that. The last thing I remember, I was showing that nice McFly kid my watch, and then I'm down here and you're yelling at me. McFly? Uh, Hi. McFly. Oh. Strickland. Go oh, hi, Martin. Give me the tapes, Edna. Mr. Tannen, please restrain our oh, guests. Ah, shit. Hey, stop. Stop. Oh, no. Watch. Biff, snap out of it. Ah. Isn't that the license plate to your car? Yeah. Sheila? Sheila. Cannon. Focus. Focus. No. Come on, Ben. Snap out of it. Edna, what are you doing? Yeah. What I've always done. Keeping Hill Valley safe from hooligans like hooligans. You and your father. Hooligans. I should have known you'd be trouble someday. Come on, Biff. Snap out of it. Ah. How do I? Biff. Whoops. Knock it off. Beer. Hey, look over there. It's beer. It's beer. 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 What's going on? Howard Tannen, obey your programming. Oh, God. Uh, uh. You see, Mr. McFly, thanks to the enhancements I've made to the oh, Citizen God, Quest you're program, you are insane. The rabid of dogs to heal. She's insane. So many you... hits. Wild Gunman. Not a fan of video games, huh? Novelties. Novelties? Biff, whoopee cushions. Never had much of a sense of humor. <gasps> cigars. Are those your favorite cigars? Yeah, those are your favorite cigars. Uh huh. Humans? Where am I? Tannen, I didn't go behind my namby pamby husband's back. So oh, you behind the husband's no back, vices. huh? Uh -huh. Yeah. Look, pinball parts. Hmm. Come on, Biff. Snap out of it. Ah. Uh. <gasps> Porn. Look, girly mags. Girly mags. Boobies. Boobies. <laughs> Boobies. Oh, that works. Tannin, Apparently, boobs is the trick. Uh, <laughs> oh my babes. god. Booze! Booze! He's, he's gonna short circuit! He's gonna short circuit! He's gonna short circuit! Oh, 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 mommy! That works. Tannin! Get up, you useless slacker! Wow! On, Edna, give the poor jerk a break. Yeah! A break! A break! You sound like my wishy-washy husband, always trying to find the good in people, never wanting to accept the fact that some people are just born bad. Maybe, but that doesn't give you the right to turn them into zombies. Yeah. yeah. Give me my dad's tapes so I can... You mean those tapes I erased while you were struggling with my zombie? What? Oh. Come on. Utopias are fragile things, Mr. McFly. What a bitch. Especially when overseen by minds as hmm. distractible as my hmm. husband's. No. No. Edna. Doc? Emmett, what are you doing here? Yeah. I came down here to investigate a troubling report involving Mr. Tanner. Doc, you gotta stop her. She... Silence! Yeah. Okay. okay. I was concerned there might be a flaw in my Citizen Plus program. Imagine my surprise when I found my wife mm. perverting my life's work. Perverting? Mm-hmm. Is 
This what it's all been about, Edna? All those years? All our struggles to cure society's illnesses? Just to create a world where free will can be turned off with a flick of a switch? Oh, please, Emmett. You wanted this just as much as I did. Remember? If only we could tell someone to stay off the grass and so help us, they would never tread foot on a well-manicured lawn again. That's what Citizen Plus does. It makes rules unbreakable. I only gave it the slightest of changes. Enough. We will not have this discussion here. But Get wait for me. Fine. She's not happy. Oh well. Huh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Doc. He's not Anna, happy. What have I done? I don't know. What have you done? I'm sure he wouldn't blame you for all this, Doc. Yeah. He was so happy when I gave up my childish dreams in favor of Edna's more practical pursuits. Oh. Are you proud of me now, Father? Wow. Oh, Jesus. Doc, don't be don't doing be so, so hard, hard on yourself. yourself. This Hill Valley may be a little messed up. Okay, a lot, okay, messed, a lot up. messed up. But you were just huh. trying to help people. Or was I just entranced by the challenge of transforming the human psyche like so many chemicals? Hmm. Hmm. I'm sorry about Edna, Doc. She didn't seem so bad back in 1931. No, she wasn't. When we were first dating, she was so spirited and principled, compassionate. When did I lose her? Did you ever have uh, her? Enough wallowing. What's done is done. It's time to look forward. Yeah. Maybe, but maybe not. What? Your notebook from the other timeline. Not this foolishness again. Look, you can use it to repair the time machine and fix all this so it never happened. Everyone could be back the yeah. way it was supposed to be. You, Edna, Jennifer, my parents. Doc, you once told me if you put your mind to it, you could accomplish anything. You can accomplish no, anything. Accomplish this. <clears throat> yeah. There's a lot of empty pages. The only <clears throat> one you need is right here. The flux capacitor. It's a capacitor that fluxes. Something or other. Oh my god. Everywhere. Scott. The design! It's like a flux capacitor. Oh, he's realizing what he's got to do! We must fix what? the things! This... this could work! This could work! It'll take Told time, ya. of course, but once it's done, we'll have all <clears throat> the time in the world! Ha <laughs> Doc? Martin, eh? we must get started at once. Come on! Alright! bring Einie along? Fluxway's no. not not... Yes, whatever! Yes. You know, I used to love dogs before Edna came along. You don't say. I'll go ahead and start preparing mm. a lab. Edna will be furious, but who cares? And start Ain't preparing a lab, not the fix. lab. Just a random lab. Woohoo! You will go fix it! Cool. Oh, look, there's a... Oh my god, the panic button! Wow, it still works. Ah. I couldn't help but resist that one. Records. Beatles, Stones, Phil Collins, Edna took all the good stuff. Oh, yeah, really? Hey, maybe I'll grab a couple for the road after I get Einstein. Oh, right, that's what I'm supposed to do. Come here, Einie. Don't worry, boy, I'll get you out of here in no time. What is it, Einie? McFly. Yeah. Hi, Biff. Uh... Hey, Biff. You okay? You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. <clears throat> Better than I've been in a long time, you know? Mm-hmm. So you remember... That witch making me do stuff? Yeah, she'll get what's coming to her. No one tells Biff Tannen what All to right, do. R.I. 4, Destroyer. Um, what? No one. Hey, I I'm the guy who snapped you out of it. Really? Because yeah. all I remember is a punk kid who thought it'd be funny to make me jump down a hole. Huh. Ah uh, shit! 
Shish kebab. Shish kebab. Panic button. Is that supposed to scare me or something? Down, Biff. I'd stay. All right. McFly. Oh crap. Yeah. All right, McFly. Time to race the music. Face. It's face the music. Yeah, it's face the music. You idiot. I hope I don't run out of rock. Panic button. Einstein? Uh, God damn, what the hell am I supposed to do? Get him, Miney. Get him, Miney. All right, let's figure this one out. Miney, sick him. Yes. Yeah. Let's get out of here, Iny. Fuck. Sorry, I took so long. That works. Came around to jump me. It's Edna. Totally laid him out with the old ruler. Hi, Edna. Martin McFly. Edna. No, it's almost impressive. How many years of work and planning you nearly ruined huh. in just a few short hours? Where's Doc? Oh, Doc. My husband is in a better place. Better place? Oh. What have you done to him? Relax, Martin. We've got everything under control. No! No! Doc! Well, shit. All right, everybody picnic. 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 Oh, to be continued. That's the end of the episode? What is this madness? That's not a way to end an episode. This is baloney. Holy crap, and that was episode three. I was expecting to um, go in and rescue Doc and fix the timeline and have some other stuff to do in the next episode. Apparently not. Here's the real story. In the next I'm episode. i fly from an alternate timeline. Edna. Why? Because you're weak, Emmett. Wow. What can I say? She's my muse. Oh. I'm not sure I like where this is going. It's almost embarrassing how devoted he is to me. You gotta <laughs> believe me, Jennifer. This whole town's gone crazy, and Citizen Brown and I are the only ones who can fix it. Yeah. There is no future for us. No. Back to the future, the game. To be continued in double visions. Awesome! Wow. That was the third episode. That ended quite abruptly. Not gonna lie, that was a lot more abrupt than ever I was expecting. I was expecting it. Did anyone expect to end that abrupt? Cause... No, no, I was not expecting to end so abruptly. Hmm. Oh well. Hmm. That cliffhanger, though. It's a cliff of hangers. Oh, my God. I can't believe that's the way it ends. Holy crap. Wow. Wow. All right. What did you guys think of episode three? Because, oh, my goodness. That's what I'm talking about. Telltale, yeah, most of the new Telltale games are pretty meh. Hmm. Wow. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed episode three. Woo, that was a doozy. That was a doozy. Holy crap.